Okay, folks, even though we have discussed the shutdown of much of Sunspot New Mexico in the comment section since it happened, apparently many of you are learning about it now and have many questions. Well, welcome to the club. No one knows what's happening, but we do know there is no major movement towards the area, at least military-wise. All the road and air activity is relatively normal for this heavy military presence part of the country. But some good guesses to start with might include something related to terrorism, like biological or chemical weapons, especially in the week before 9-11. And with the site set to be shut down anyway, there is the enormous question of the mercury up there for the facility, and of course any sensitive material related to the military sites nearby. One thing we know is that it has nothing to do with the current space weather. This observatory doesn't even monitor geomagnetic storms like the weak to moderate one we're having the last few days. It models and serves as backup in case of our satellites going down. So as you have seen in our daily show, space weather is enhanced, but nothing terrifying. It did happen after the shutdown and has nothing to do with this old retiring observatory. But getting back to the other possibilities, the first one sort of speaks for itself. For more on the presence of the Mercury, you can look up Liquid Mirror Telescope, and it's too long a topic to get into in detail here, but the danger of Mercury is real, and if not maintained, what stops that facility from being degraded or being ransacked? There is so much military stuff in the Southwest that this old building probably isn't related to any of it, especially with the old technology, but then again, that is what we'd be supposed to think. In truth, we'll probably never know if it was something shocking, and we'll get a tamer story like anthrax or something either way. Now, here are some lightning rings in Hurricane Florence, followed by the storm swell and major rainfall forecast for the region. I'll see you in the morning. Be safe, everyone.